these things don't come under uh, our newborn emergency since now we are started doing the thyroid levels for all the newborns at birth. So normally these emergencies have come down. Now, uh, CAH, congenital adrenal hyperplasia, is basically another uh, emergency which we uh, normally don't find in our uh, emergency cases. Because again, like I told you, we are doing all the metabolic uh, uh, involvements of metabolism. So we are doing all the, uh, you know, glucose card we are doing. So normally these things aren't been taken care of that time only. So cortical deficiency, if they're there, we find that the child is having hypoglycemia, hypotension, and shock. Now, if we have got an <clears throat> aldosterone deficiency, so we can find hyponatremia, hyperkalemia, and dehydration. So these things we have to look into. Treatment, like I told you, electrolytes, glucose management, <clears throat> get a uh, hydroxyprogesterone levels, get a cortisone levels, aldosterone renin levels. Now, how do we treat this? Uh, we basically go to see the dehydration, treat hyponatremia or hyperkalemia, and... Uh, Hypoglycemia, like I had explained to you, you can go ahead to treat hypoglycemia accordingly. And um, uh, when we administer steroids in these cases, it should be hydrocortisone 1 to 2 mg per kg IV, which should be followed by 6 hourly dose of that. Uh, this will just uh, go ahead with these things. Okay, now metabolic disorders. Uh, we have to understand that basically... Uh, in newborns, always consider an underlying metabolic uh, disorders such as congenital adrenal hyperplasia, which is already gone ahead with. So I'm just going to go uh, with these things. Okay, now you have to understand what are the clinical features. This is an important slide. Now, newborns may present with poor weight gain, feeding difficulties, lethargy, MSS, diarrhea, and decreased movement. Female and male patient, infants with CAH present with slight variations. Females will likely have an ambiguous genitalia with enlarged clitoris. Males to present with salt wasting and electrolyte abnormalities, including hyponatremia, hypokalemia, and hypokalemia. Investigations, like I told, glucose level, blood, blood gases levels, multiple metabolic abnormalities uh, can be done by inborn, uh, to rule out inborn errors of metabolism, go with the glucose card. Uh, electrolyte derangements to be checked and ACTH cortisol levels, uh, amino acid levels, lactate levels should be done. Treatment I have already uh, discussed with you, dextrose uh, to check for the hypoglycemia, steroids uh, like I told you and correct the electrolyte and abnormalities as indicated. That has to be done. Okay, now let's come to the next part which is in monarism metabolism, this we have already discussed, so we are not going to go in detail with this. <clears throat> I'm just trying to take the most important thing. Now, the most important thing is sepsis. Now, uh, see, I'll try to discuss it out uh, very short. Yeah.